Hello, hello, welcome back to another anime art video. In today's video, I'm going to be drawing from Tokyo Ghoul Season 2, Episode 9. Snine, yeah. Um, hold on, I gotta turn up the brightness on my uh, iPad. This is an old iPad, by the way. Um, but it does what I need it to do. So, I'm going to be drawing this. This. This picture, I, I was thinking about, like, maybe doing uh, either this one. If you watched the episode, you know that there was two, uh, well, three prominent uh, characters that showed up. Well, two characters that showed up, one character that, you know, it was actually confirmed in the episode that that is who that is. So, it was the, I think it was the Black Dogs. Yeah, so the Black Dogs and then this, uh, these dudes, of course. This, I like this. One thing I need to do, though along this art journey is I've watched a, a, quite a few YouTubers in my in my journey on the YouTube road before I started making my own videos um, but I was uh, I would always I would always watch a fair amount of artists and some artists would say that one thing that they wish they did from the beginning of their journey was do more uh, real life or like you know like um realism drawing and that's what i need to do because honestly in my perspective from when i drew my uh when i drew the hand the other uh in the other video it didn't look that good <laughs> but these ones can come out good and the the line work for these, I thought that maybe I can do the same type of line work for the hand, but it didn't work the same way it felt like. It felt like there was more to what I was seeing in a hand or, or you know, if I was to draw a body part, I think that there would be more involved in, in it than just the line. I don't know. That's just my perspective, but I do have classes, not like, you know, classes, classes, like going to a school or something, but like, uh, Udemy classes, there, there's a Udemy class that I, that I had for a while, and it's on, um, teaching you the anatomy, everything about the anatomy, and all that, I don't know if I'll make videos about it, probably, possibly, possibly, if I get to the point, if I can get my sleeping schedule under wraps, which it sh kind of should be, because I woke up today at 2, which is better for me. It's better than waking up at 5. So, if I can get my sleeping schedule under wraps, and I can, like, start waking up, if I can start going to sleep at, like, maybe 12. Go to sleep at 12, and then wake up at 5 or 4, right? Because they say your body needs how much hours of sleep? Uh, was it four hours of sleep or five hours of sleep? I don't remember. It was one of those. It was. It, it was actually. It was might might have been five or six. Five or six hours of sleep to be comfortably, uh, you know, to be comfortable in waking up, and that's as much as your body needs. And you don't want to oversleep or undersleep. That was like the right amount, but. If I do that and I wake up early, I can, like, if I put my mind to it and then I'm like, oh, do a video now, do a video now, right? I can do, like, the anime one earlier in the day and then, like, a little bit later in the day. The video might not come up the same day, but it'll definitely come up. It'll definitely get done. Nah. I'll try and get, I can try and get an anime and an actual uh, real life drawing done in the same day. So if I decide, you know, if I can get that all together, I'll start posting 
two videos a day, one for each, and then I'll be uh, enhancing my art ability. I'll draw. I'll be drawing twice a day, which is more. You know, it's more practice. It's more time. You know, and um, I have the time to do so. So m why not go all out in my practice to make myself better?
Okay, we're finished with this one. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Let me erase the access. Wait, hold on. One of these days, I'm going to show you guys all the art stuff that I have. Because I know, like, during these videos, I just be pulling out, like, I'll just pull out, like, something random. And, uh,. I know you guys are probably like, well, if this is your beginning of your uh, art journey, how do you already have all this stuff? Basically, long story short, uh, when I had my old job, well, when I had my job, well, I don't know why I said old job, because obviously if I said I had it, then that means it's don't have it anymore um but i i would always the first th okay the first thing i bought i bought i was into martial arts i'm still into martial arts i just i don't do it anymore because i got injured when i was doing it and i couldn't kick anymore i was doing taekwondo so kicking is like a heavy part of that martial art specifically so uh when i got injured it was my i injured first i injured my left big toe and then like the next week the very next week i injured my right one too uh it was it was my own fault i tried to um I was sparring with somebody and I tried to I tried to keep my left foot safe because it was still injured, it was still hurt. So I tried to keep it safe and I ended up pivoting wrong and like going down to the ground because I couldn't handle the weight uh cuz uh on, on my left foot. So I tried to compensate by thrusting my right foot into the ground and then my right big toe got messed up as well. So I hurt both big toes within a span of two weeks. <laughs> so, but I uh, I used to spend a lot of my money from my paychecks on, you know, like, because I was trying to look for something to do, like something to get into, like, you know, uh, I don't know if I want to make this video too long, but basically I wanted a task. I wanted, I wanted to do something more and I, I wanted to go like anything that I do I want to go far in it so when I was doing martial arts what I wanted I, what I was planning on doing was I was planning on being like one of the greatest martial artists I was planning on you know um, going to like uh, one of the big goals was you know going to the Olympics but never never panned out obviously but that's it for this video. I'll I'll go over all that stuff in another video, but um this is what this I think it looks really cool actually. I don't know if I should start like when I see like a piece like this where the color's gone should I like do that over here I don't know because I don't know if it makes it I don't know what it does to it per se but that's it for this video if you liked it be sure to leave a like uh, subscribe glove is off peace love thanks for watching